Hi guys, welcome to AJ's Paintings. Um, today I'm in a mood for um, ocean inspired art. So I took this canvas, this is 12 by 16, and I took the paints that remind me of the ocean. Um, and then let's see what happens. So I'm gonna use white as my uh, backdrop. And then I have Thalo Green, Turquoise, Metallic Blue, Cobalt Blue, Aqua, and here I have mixed Thalo Green and metallic blue with a little bit of gray. So this is just gray that I, you know, mixed in. And I got this beautiful color. I don't know if you can see it. It's beautiful. And then I have this darker blue. And here I just mixed some metallic blue with black. Okay, so I'm gonna start with white. So making sure it's clean and I think I'm gonna put pour mostly on this side just going to spread it all these paints are mixed with Floetrol and water I have the same exact same ratio for all of them including the white one part paint two parts flow trawl and a little bit less than the one part water okay so this side is all um, white now I'm thinking maybe I want a little bit but I'm not going to I have like a thick white base here so let's see if I can spread it to really thin because I want to have something there but nothing you know to so that it floods the canvas too much oops okay so I'm just gonna use my hand because I don't want it to be too thick because I find if I put too much paint on it at this point, um, because I'll be putting too many other colors on it, once it's done, it just keeps moving. And I don't like that because then it just changes the composition once it's dry. Okay, so I just a very, very thin layer of the white on this part and this thicker on this part. Okay. Let me get some paper towel. All right. Okay, now I need to pop all these bubbles before I can move on. I'm going to use this butane torch. Oh, there we go. <laughs> ah! Ooh. What's going on with this thing? I think I should buy a new one <laughs> because this one is just doing its own thing now. Okay, so it's behaving, that's good. Okay, I don't need to worry too much about that part because there's not a lot of paint there. Okay let's move on and I think I'm gonna start with the Thalo green just making sure it's and I'm just gonna not worry about too much like how I put it on 
And once I'm done with all of them, then I'll see if I have enough paint or not. I might even go back and pour some more. But let's... Oh, okay. So this one just... I'm just going to pour it like this. It's easier when I'm doing big puddles like that. Okay. And metallic blue. Oh, the all these paints are either um, Artist Loft or um, Liquitex Basic. I got some Arteza paints, but I still have to mix them. So I mix them a little bit to try some, but I find it easy when I have these squeeze bottles ready to go and I don't have to mix it every time before I start a new painting. If I do that, then it will take me forever. <laughs> so I think I'm going to just sit down someday and then mix them all. So I will have something to go on. So right now it just looks like a big mess. Hopefully it won't once we start blowing it. Okay, and this one is aqua. Sorry, that one was cobalt blue. Oh, I love this. a little bit on the white there we go and this one you know I was mixing my blue and uh, thalo green to get like I was hoping to make a dark you know dark blue shade um, like, like kind of like mm, towards more green blue and I added a little bit of gray but I just loved it so much and I was like okay I'm gonna stop I'm not going to make it darker and then I mix the, the darker shade separately. But this looks so good. Oh my god. I don't know if you can see it on the camera. But it's beautiful. And it has that metallic in it. Because the blue is metallic blue. Okay, so now this is my dark shade. This is uh, blue, metallic blue and black. Not going to put it too much right now and then later on I'll see if I need to add you know shadows somewhere then I'll go back and add more oh and I'm gonna add a little bit of gold sorry I didn't put it in before <laughs> but love a little bit of gold here and there so not put, put too much just there that's it okay Let's see how the torch, torch is going to behave now. See, it's doing that thing. They, I don't know why. When it starts on a certain flame and it just goes boom. Oh, that's scary. Okay. Let's do this. I don't know how it's going to go. This hair dryer I've been using. It was fine before, but all of a sudden I feel like it doesn't have that much power anymore. So sometimes it does the trick, sometimes it doesn't. I have to switch my hair dryer. But let's see if this time it will actually work. Oh, let me just put a little bit more white in here. Teeny bit. So I have more, you know, flexibility with blowing it over. Alright, let's start. I think I'm gonna stop. Uh, this part, maybe a little bit more. Nice. Okay. Okay. 
Nice. Oh, I love that. I hope it stays like that. Because with uh, Dutch pores, you never know <laughs> if they're going to stay or not. But so far, so good. I'm just going to go on the sides and cover them with whatever the paint dripped on the side. But I like it. I, I think the lacing and a little bit of cells are developing. So I'm just going to give it a little bit more time and then see if I need to play with it a little bit more. I would have loved to see a bit more dark, the, the dark shade here and there, but I don't want to touch it. It looks so good. Okay, let's just do the sides a little bit and then I'm going to see if I actually need to touch it. Okay, let me do the size and then I'll come back. Okay, so I'm back. I did all the size and so far it's holding. So that's really good. I love how there it's so much lacing and the cells. It's amazing. It's beautiful. I'm going to bring you down and I'll show you the close up, but I absolutely love it. It worked. Awesome. So I think I'm going to try a couple more with this, with these colors, because I just love how it looks. All right, I'm going to bring you guys closer. One second. Okay, guys, so here is the close-up. Look at those cells. Just amazing. And the lacing. I love how the gold shimmers. Look at that. Beautiful. And there is this. Look at that. I hope it stays and doesn't just go over. But I love this. Thank you so much, guys. Thank you so much for watching. Please don't forget to subscribe, like, and share. And I'll see you in my next video. Bye.